Peppa visits the Australian Botanical Gardens. Peppa had flown to Australia to visit her friend Kylie Kangaroo. Wow! Did you tell them we were coming? asked Mummy Pig. <coughs> no, I thought you did, said Daddy Pig, ringing the doorbell. <coughs> Mr Pig, said Mr Kangaroo, opening the door. Eh, what, what an amazing surprise. <coughs> you said we should visit if we were passing again, said Daddy Pig. <coughs> yeah, for sure, said Mr Kangaroo. <coughs> Kylie and Mrs Kangaroo came to say hello. Joey Kangaroo popped his head out of Mrs. Kangaroo's pouch and waved his toy crocodile. Ah, crocodile! He said. Dinosaur! Ooh. George growled back. <laughs> we were just going to the botanical gardens, said Mr. Kangaroo. Did you want to join us? Yes, please, cheered Peppa and her family. On the journey, Kylie told Peppa all about the botanical gardens. Oh! There's a rock garden, a desert track, a rainforest dome, a nature reserve, and the best bit, said Kylie. <coughs> Why don't you leave the best bit as a surprise, said Mr. Kangaroo. <coughs> OK, Daddy, <coughs> said Kylie. You'll love the gardens, Peppa. They're wild. Wow. I can't wait. <coughs> said Peppa. You don't need to, said Mrs Kangaroo. We're here. Hooray! The first area to explore was a rock garden. <gasps> These rocks are so big, gasped Peppa. I wish we had them at home. <coughs> Let's go across the wibbly wobbly rope bridge, said Kylie. <coughs> wibble wobble wibble wobble, sang Peppa and Kylie as he skipped along the bridge. <laughs> Joey crept towards Daddy Pig with a toy crocodile. Stop! shouted Joey. Ah! cried Daddy Pig. <coughs> Don't worry, Daddy Pig. There aren't any crocodiles around, said Mr. Kangaroo. <coughs> In this garden, at least. He looked over at Kylie and winked. <coughs> at the other end of the wibbly wobbly rope bridge was the outback desert track. <coughs> We have to hop along the track and find the gum tree, said Kylie. But how do we know what the gum tree looks like? asked Peppa. It has a shiny silver trunk, explained Kylie. And it's the only tree in the whole track. Wow! Ooh, said Peppa. Ready, steady, go, shouted Kylie. Peppa and Kylie ran across the desert track to the gum tree. It's a bit hot here, panted Daddy Pig. <coughs> well, we are in the desert, said Mummy Pig. <coughs> Peppa loved the silver gum tree. <coughs> it's so shiny, she said. <coughs> I wish we had one at home. <coughs> Is this a surprise, Kylie? <coughs> no, said Kylie. I love the gum tree, but it's not the best bit. <coughs> The next part of the gardens was inside a big glass dome. Wow. This is the rainforest dome, said Kylie. We have lots of rainforests in Australia. Oh. Wow! <coughs> gasped Peppa, gazing up at the tall trees. Why is it called a rainforest? <coughs> because it's a forest, said Kylie. <coughs> and it rains a lot. Oh. Ah! <coughs> said Peppa. But it's not raining now. Let's push the big buttons and see what happens, said Kylie. Kylie and Peppa pushed the buttons and suddenly, pitter-patter, it started to rain. I love rainforest domes, said Peppa. I wish we had one at home. A room with warm rain, said Daddy Pig. We do need one at home. <laughs> we have one, Daddy Pig said Mummy Pig. It's called the shower. <coughs> Is this a surprise, Kylie? <coughs> asked Peppa. No, said Kylie. Rainforests are brilliant, but this isn't the best bit. <coughs> bring, bring. Suddenly, there was a loud bring. <coughs> oh dear, what was that? <coughs> asked Mummy Pig. <coughs> Don't worry, said Mrs Kangaroo. That was a bellbird. Their calls can be a little alarming. Oh, I see, 
Mummy Pig shouted over the ringing. Is this a surprise, Kylie? Asked Peppa. No, said Kylie. Bell birds are great, but this isn't the best bit. Outside the rainforest dome was a nature reserve. This is a nice spot for lunch, said Mr. Kangaroo, whipping out a picnic. Mm. Mr. Duckbilled Platypus, gasped Peppa. So nice to see you again. She always finds us when we have a picnic, said Kylie. After the picnic, Peppa and Kylie looked up at the trees. Let's pretend we're possums running along the branches at night, said Kylie, showing Peppa how to run like a possum. <laughs> Look, whispered Peppa, spotting something in a tree. What's that? It's a koala, Kylie whispered back. Wow. She looks sleepy because she sleeps most of the day, and when she's not sleeping, she's munching leaves. She's so cute, said Peppa. Is this the surprise, Kylie? No, said Kylie. Koalas are amazing, but they're not the best bit. Let's pretend to be koalas, said Peppa. Munch, munch, munch. I love koalas, said Peppa. I wish we had them at home. <sighs> Come on, little ones, said Mrs. Kangaroo. It's time for... Yikes, cried Daddy Pig. A crocodile! It's not a real one, said Kylie. It's a crocodile slide, leading to the surprise. Ooh, said Peppa, climbing to the top of the slide. Then she slid down into a huge muddy puddle. Wow! This is the best bit, Peppa! yelled Kylie, landing in the mud. It's the best thing ever! cheered Peppa. <laughs> After lots of slides down the crocodile into huge muddy puddle, it was time for everyone to go home. Did you like the gardens, Peppa? asked Kylie. Yes! said Peppa. I loved them, and the best bit was the surprise. Urgh, crocodile, growled George. He loved the crocodile. Australian gardens have everything, said Peppa. I wish we could bring them home with us. I don't think they would fit on the plane, Peppa, said Mummy Pig. We'll just have to come back and visit again, won't we, said Daddy Pig. <laughs> Yes, cheered Peppa and Kylie. <laughs> sure, said Mr. Kangaroo. Drop by any time. Uh, yeah, of course, said Mrs. Kangaroo. Any time. Peppa loves the Australian Botanical Gardens. Everyone loves the Australian Botanical Gardens. <laughs> the end. Hi kids, did you have fun watching this video? Then like and subscribe for more!